pleasant good day my beloved brothers and sisters on this sunday in the month of june 2017 well once again this is your christian brother eric braxton speaking to you all from his beloved country trinidad and tobago the land of my nativity the land of my birth this wonderful island country trinidad and tobago of course that is in the blue caribbean sea on this current series about the bachelor grove i already um, record a few videos on Bachelor Grove and already post it on the internet and the world wide web on YouTube. So look out for this video, um, The Bachelor Grove by Eric Braxton. In this continuous, this continuous series that I'm recording these host of videos dealing with the Bachelor Grove, warning people that are heading to the Bachelor Grove and they are buying up the spirit box. To communicate with the dead members of the bachelor families and they are recording videos about the tombs of the bachelor families i just want to warn all these people who are coming from chicago texas los angeles california boston massachusetts Illinois, chicago new york miami Lee, miami florida from different parts of the united states from hawaii and those who are leaving and who are coming who are, who are also reading and watch who are also watching videos on the internet dealing with bachelor grove and leaving the native country whether they come from africa or europe or asia or from the west indies and heading to bachelor grove or from the middle east heading to bachelor grove to to um to communicate with the dead members of the bachelor family and of course to see the exact location um of the bachelor grove the cemetery of the bachelor family that is in chicago which have gained the reputation the reputation the most haunted cemetery in the world or the most haunted cemetery throughout the united states of america i just want to say to all the boys and girls the old folks and the young folks who are heading in the bachelor grove with the intention to communicate with the, all the dead members of the bachelor family who have settled there in the 18th century in the different parts of the bachelor grove where the tomb is in different geographical location in the bachelor bachelor grove that private bachelor family cemetery of the dead members of the bachelor family who have died and buried there you all cannot communicate with none of the dead members of the bachelor family why because the dead do not know anything and let me quote from the script as the psalms the living know that they shall die but the dead do not know anything yes brothers and sisters the dead do, do not know anything this is the teaching of the bible the teaching of god brothers and sisters all of you all are heading in the bachelor grove family and communicating and claim that you all are receiving communication through all the spirit box from dead members of the bachelor family no my friend that communication that you all are receiving from through all the spirit box it is the fallen angels that are communicating with you all fooling all you making all you believe that you all are receiving um, communication from dead members of the bachelor family the dead do not know anything the dead are the dead their consciousness has ceased. They are waiting for a resurrection, future resurrection, when God resurrects the dead. So all those in the bachelor family who have been fooled over the years and continue to be fooled by the fallen angels who, who, are, who have inhabited that, that geographical location, the bachelor grove, and they are the ones who are causing all that deception in the bachelor family, in the bachelor grove. All the, the all the anomalies the blue lights and the green lights and the white lights that are tend to appear in the daytime and the nighttime amongst the trees in the bachelor grove so the visitors that record these balls of lights that appear in green lights blue lights green lights and when they appear to approach the light the lights have disappear or move away further from them and and when they have when they have moved away the light come back to the ge geographical location it was or the light move amongst the trees and totally vanish and disappear and then for a little while appear back again and the term it the mystery lights in the bachelor family and all the apparition of spirit that appear in the bachelor grove that is a fallen angels taking apparition personating the dead members 
of the bachelor family. Brothers and sisters, it is a deception that the fallen angels are perpetuating on all the people that appear that go to the bachelor family. The bachelor, the bachelor group to communicate with the dead members of the bachelor family. You all are being fooled and deceived by the fallen angels because they are the ones who are who are perpetuating that deception in the bachelor grove. The dead do not know anything, brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters, and you also are being fooled and deceived by these paranormal researchers who believe they are genuinely communicating with dead members of the bachelor family, not knowing it is a fallen angels who are fooling them, thinking thinking they believe, thinking that they are communicating with the dead member, thinking that they are communicating with the dead members of the bachelor family and receiving messages from the dead members of the bachelor family with a spirit box, when they take out the spirit box and rest it on the tomb, and when they hold it in the hand and speaking to the dead members of the family to speak to them. It is the fallen angels who are speaking through these instruments, giving out message to these to all these people who come to the bachelor grove with the intention to communicate with the dead members of the bachelor family. So then how do these spirits know, how do these fallen angels have knowledge about the dead members of the bachelor's family? Of course, yes, why? Because when all these members of the dead of the bachelor family, when they was alive, the fallen angels was right there. So of course they know the history, the history of these people so when these people have died and buried in the bachelor grove, they are the one who are the fallen angels who already know the history of these people when they was alive. They are the one who are given all the information by working through these instruments, the spirit box, to reveal that information to all the people who come to the bachelor grove. But the people who come to the bachelor grove, the young boys and girls who come to record videos, and to have and to get a look at the bachelor grove in their geographical location that the cemetery is in when they receive these messages they believe genuinely believe that they are receiving these messages from the dead members of the bachelor grove family who have died and buried there not knowing that there's a fallen angels who are personating to be the dead members of the bachelor family giving all this information to these people and tricking and fooling all of them it is a deception that is being perpetrated perpetuated upon all the people that enter the bachelor group by the fallen angels brothers and sisters why because the dead do not know anything god cannot lie and god is true and the holy scriptures is true you see when someone die the consciousness cease they do not know anything the only how they will get back the consciousness is when god bring them up in a future resurrection but i will deal with that topic more further and more details in depth in the next video that is to come brothers and sisters so in this video i just want to all who, all those who are fortunate to see all the videos that i've recorded and current currently this video on the internet i want you all to appreciate everything that i'm saying because i'm not i have not set out with any intention to mislead you all but to give you all the truth and to point you all in the right direction and to know and i want you all to know exactly what is taking place in the bachelor grove brothers and sisters and I know that the young boys and girls with the cameras they are so excited they have a joy in the heart they are excited that when they enter the bachelor group they want to communicate with the dead you know so they could post you know they want to hear voices they want to see operations so they could record these things and place it in videos and post it in the internet to so tell their friends and their loved ones and the co-workers and the family members you know have gone in the bachelor group you understand and i have spoken to the dead members of the bachelor family to tell the friends and the family look i have i have recorded a video with an apparition up here you know they're excited but not knowing they are being deceived by the fallen angels that inhabit the bachelor grove these evil spirits yes brothers and sisters that is the that is the that is the deception that the fallen angels are perpetuating on these people that enter the, the bachelor grove brothers and sisters so this is your christian brother eric braxton speaking to you all from my native country trinidad and tobago way down in the west indies warning you all about what is exactly taking place in the bachelor group 
in United States of America, Chicago, which have become the most famous haunted cemetery in United States of America. And if no one is not telling you all that in United States of America, this little Christian boy, this little Christian child that is in this country way down in the West Indies is pointing out you all, pointing out to all of you all that hardcore truth, that hardcore facts, accept it and embrace it a full 100%. Because everything I'm saying to you all is the truth. There is no deception in it, but the plain truth. And if I have to be the lonely voice in the wilderness crying out, and I will keep on pointing out that truth to you all because I want to lead you all in the right direction, not in the deception that you all are entering into and engaging all yourself into, not knowing that is the fallen angels are being you all are being tricked and fooled by the fallen angels. You all are not communicating with no member of the bachelor family because the dead members of the bachelor family do not know anything. The dead do not know anything. Pick up the Bible, buy a Bible, and start blowing the dust off it and start reading it from Genesis to Revelation. And you will hear what the word of God says. Do not take it from me. Do not take my words. Yet still, I want you all to accept it the words that I've given you all because it's truth but for your own do your own investigation by using the Bible as all your compass and guide brothers and sisters brothers and sisters well brothers and sisters this this 12 minutes or 13 minute short video I cannot say everything that I need to say so look out for the other videos in this continuous series about the deception that is taking place in the bachelor groove that the fallen angels is perpetuating on every boy and girl that enter the bachelor groove from time to time, brothers and sisters. Well, bye bye, my friends. Make that decision today and accept Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. Get a Bible, bow one, buy one, own one, and start reading it from Genesis to Revelation, the original King James, and, and start observing Saturday as a Sabbath day. Look for a Bible believing church. And give a life to Christ and preach a gospel of the kingdom and warn others. And preach a gospel of the kingdom and tell others about the wonderful good news of salvation. That Jesus Christ our Lord is coming back soon to establish his divine government kingdom upon this earth. To bring true peace and love and true posterity for the whole human family. Where the whole human family will live in true peace, love and brotherly and sisterly camaraderie with one another. In the wonderful kingdom of God. So bye bye my friend. May the peace of God be with you and with me. The whole human family. From this day forth and forevermore. See you all in the next video soon.